It's Paddy's Day on NGP, so won't you raise a drink with me? We celebrate a Catholic saint by getting shit-faced, ain't that quaint? I hope you all a lucky charms and have green sleeves upon your arms. It's Paddy's Day, oh don't you see, we're celebrating on NGP. I'm sorry if you're stuck at home, unable to go drink and roam, but you can still partake and cheer. Well, NGP drinks lots of beer. Oh, NGP drinks lots of beer. Amen. Oh my God! Amen. I have tears. That was Amen. the voice of an angel. God oh, beautiful. came down himself. <sighs> I'm surprised Fulptron worked. <laughs> <laughs> the first time. The first time Fulptron has ever worked was today. There, there's I no think... way Fulptron was going to die with that angel singing. I think Fulptron <laughs> is drinking, and that's why he's working. He only works when he's drunk. It's a St. Patrick's yeah. Day miracle. <laughs> yeah, miracle. Well, hi, everybody. Welcome to the Newgrounds podcast. This is the Welcome impromptu... St. Patrick's Day episode, and we've got a treat for you. This show is 100% unplanned. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. How who I'm are like. you, people? Who just said that? Who's who's the guy who just said that? I don't know, but I, he I has the voice. voice of an angel. That's all I know. That's all I know. I haven't, I haven't heard his voice before. He must be who new to this podcast. Himself? Oh, it's me! Yeah. It's me! It's Psycho Goldfish, your uh, friendly neighborhood guy that does a lot of shit on Newgrounds. That nobody knows about. Friendly the drunk down the block. A lot of shit on New. I can't even name one thing that you've done on Newgrounds. No, nobody can. That's the beauty of my I'm job. Not. It's so secret. I think he made a mini putt game one time. He might have. <laughs> or four of them. Who knows? He made that that uh, toss the turtle knockoff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that fucking cheap knockoff. He's got, he's got a lot of nerve. Taking other people's work like that. See, what are you, what are you doing on this podcast? Oh yeah, it's me, Ninja Muffin ninety nine. It's me, Cam, Ninja Muffin ninety nine. Well, I am Henry Evil. Yes, that fuck. I fucked it up again. That was unintentional. <laughs> God damn it. I, I was. I meant to say I'm Henry E. Yes. Don't worry about. It. I'm Henry Yes. Yeah. Continue. The E stands for <laughs> excessively Goodell. fucking up. Uh. <laughs> I'm I'm Goodell, and I'm here as well. well so no. we're off. We're off to a great start here. It's the it's the drinking special. Everyone, get your get your cans. Drink up. All right. God, yeah, I, I don't know if we explain that. I, wish I this, could open cans. This is uh, uh, here's this, here's we're, one we're, for you, this Henry. This is our St. Patrick's Day episode. Th- this is a nitro can. Are you ready for this? I'm not ready. Oh, oh, oh fuck shit. yeah! Yeah, I just came a little. <laughs> <laughs> I did. Too. So, uh, breaking news. On Newgrounds, if you look at, uh, if you go to the front page, go to the front page and you go to Artist News, the top thing right now on the front front page of Artist News is Miracle saying, Exit the Gungeon. Exit the Gungeon just came out. It's, uh, it's a follow-up to Enter the Gungeon, but it's not a sequel. It's not Enter the Gungeon 2, so expect something different. I just bought it and I'm very excited to go check it out right when, right when we're done with this. I fucking... Love Enter the Gungeon, and I am very excited to see this. Follow so if you if you enter cool. the Gungeon, then you exit the Gungeon. What do you suppose the next installment's going to be? Swing around to the back door of the Gungeon. <laughs> Hang around in the Gungeon. Who let the Gungeon? Go back out? to the Gungeon. It's <laughs> the next one's going to be all of the characters from Enter the Gungeon hanging out like around a campfire, reminiscing about the days that they were in the Gungeon. <laughs> <laughs> The flashback episode. Remember yeah. the Gungeon. Remember the Gungeon. Gungeon clip show. It'll be a visual novel. I'm fucking so excited to yes. play Eggs at the Gungeon. Are we done with this podcast yet? Yeah, that's it. That's the only shout out. That's the only shout out of this podcast. Yep. And my spotlight for the week is absolutely nothing. <laughs> wow. Let's let's set things straight. Cycle Goldfish. He's big drinking. Henry Eyes. Big drinking. Goodell. Big drinking. Me. I'm the designator dri- designated driver. Oh, yeah? Yeah, well, yeah. Oh, he's know. the designated oh, driver, the only guy that can't talk right now. Listen, <laughs> listen. <laughs> Drunk is contagious, okay? It's true. It's the corona beer virus. Yeah. 
It's St. Patrick's Day special. I gotta, I gotta fit in with you guys. <laughs> Tom in the chat just said, I don't have a mic. I'd use my phone, which would probably work, but meh. That is the bullshittest thing Tom. I've ever heard in my life. Tom, Tom, Tom Dun- <laughs> come on, Tom. Special guest Tom, special guest Tom, confirmed special it's going to happen. Thomas Falls. Also, Algin just said Corona Beerus, which Ooh. I fully agree with. I, I agree 100%. God. Okay. Good. Tom, the entire chat is demanding that you join. Do it and you're cool. Do it and you're cool. Do, do it, and, it cool. and you're cool. Peer pressure, peer <laughs> pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure. This is the drinking game for this episode. Every time Henry Eyes talks, you take a shot. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, no. Well, shit, I'm, uh, I'm way ahead of this. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Henry, stop. Henry. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ in heaven. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Yeah. Thus launches the Henry Eyes monologue. <laughs> Oh, uh, I just spilled on my desk. I gotta drink it off my desk. Hang on. <laughs> that sounded so like you were snorting it off your desk. Well, sometimes it's easier to use the nose. <laughs> Waste like not, want not. Like we're living in a world of shortages right now, people. You gotta do yeah. what you gotta do. Any port in the storm. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a that's a thing, too, is uh, lots of people are l- locked up right now. Why? Yeah. What, what's, so going, hope- what's going on, Goodell? Explain the situation. <laughs> Uh, so I hope you all stocked up before before the whole quarantine thing, because uh, quarantine for what? For for beer, you gotta stock up on beer for the virus. <laughs> oh God, I actually went to the fucking store and it was all gone. I was so surprised. I was like, ah, the only one that was left was the fucking Corona beer. I mean, it's almost <laughs> like a guy. <laughs> I'm being serious here. That actually happens. It's so strange. Oh, uh. We gotta, we gotta play this. We gotta play this. So, Real Faction did a thing. I'm gonna, can I play, can I play a song real quick? You, you have to. Okay. You have to, Real, it's already... Real Faction did this. This is fresh off the presses. Real Faction sampled, uh, episode five of the podcast with RGP Anims and Henry Eyes, both of them shouting at each other, both of them getting angry, and it's a bump and beat. The man just keeps me on edge. There we go. Oh yeah. Hasn't even started and I'm already came a little. <laughs> Thank you everyone for listening. I'll see you next time, I guess. flip side okay that's the end of the podcast
the end of the podcast. Oh, fucking oh. incredible. <laughs> so good. So, Henry, why do you hate Ryan? <laughs> what? 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 Why? Why? Yourself. It's playing why? Yourself. why? Why are you so mean to RGP Annans? Listen to me, listen to me. The man, he just he just pushes me to the edge. How? Why? He's a dirty he foreigner! He stole he my motherfucking catchphrase! <laughs> <laughs> no one would know that, that, that I say that. I've been saying it for years. And all of a sudden, he pops it out on air. On the podcast. So good. You should have trademarked that shit, but you know. Yeah catch you on the flip side <laughs> i said it ironically but now i say it unironically it's your i will it's catch your you all on the flip side can, can we all it's agree stupid. though that nobody else is allowed to call everything delicious that's henry 100 okay. absolutely that is that's henry. Yeah, that, that is, is also awesome. 100 percent and anybody touches that i i will kill them for you henry do you have the power to ban their account if they if they do i'll fucking delete their account Fucking what powers do you have? Shove it up Tom's ass sideways, it's gone. <laughs> somebody said while we were playing that, and I can't find it now, I was going to read it, but somebody said, I can't believe I remember all of the things that were sampled in this song. It's and that's funny loud. to me, because that episode came out today. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to the cast live. <laughs> to be fair, given, given what today is, I can't remember five minutes ago, so... Well, yeah. that's the thing too is I can't find that message, and I can't decide if it's like was deleted or if I did it happen or did I imagine it? I saw it too. What's real? What's not? All right, it's some T- Patrick's Day vision. I'm going to introduce a new segment to the podcast now. It's called Psycho yes. Goldfish reads from like old pages of his PM log. Wow. <laughs> Yes. yes. Sent July 5th, 2008. Ad in games with adult rating. Is it true that game or movies with an adult rating can have ads in it? And if so, would it be possible so that they can in the future? And if not, comma, okay, exclamation mark. Thank you. Sent by Henry Eyes. <laughs> Oh yeah! I oh, I forgot. Catch you on the flip game. side was at the end of that. I forgot. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> so, is it, is it true that ad can be added to adult games? Yes. Yes, it is. So you can make. No, it it's not. No, it isn't. It's impossible. I, I can confirm. I did not reply to this PM. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and I wonder what else, what other gold I got in here. It's, I got like fifty pages of PMs because I never delete them. <laughs> Uh oh! Here we here we go. The subject is question mark question mark question mark question mark question mark question mark question mark. Sent August third, two thousand eight. What kind of money? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what kind I love how you went money? into an English accent. <laughs> A question mark, what, question mark, what question kind mark, of question money? mark. You gotta class it up. Oh, wait, we've got a similar one here. What does this say? Uh, the subject is dollar sign, dollar sign, dollar sign. Sent okay. August 9th, 2008. How much money do you get per ads? Thank you. <laughs> How much money do you get per ads? You get like 10 exactly. cents. Three! Money. You get three. Uh, three, three money, money per ads? <laughs> Fuck. God, that's crazy. Wait, like wait, idea. hold on, hold on. Is that possible? Wait, I just wait, realized. Wait, 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 hold on. Oh, oh yeah. Crack open. Crack open. So, is this the Ryan's record for the when, most when, dead when, air on a podcast or what? <laughs> Probably. When, when I was I... drinking. <laughs> Gallo Jolt just asked, how much drink have you guys had then so far? I think you shot some prob. Hold on. Question mark, question mark, question mark. How much drink? I'm gonna shake my trash can. What does that sound like? That's how many I have. Sounds, fucking <laughs> sounds like sounds like you have a problem. Sounds like somebody is shaking a trash can. You ought to get that looked at. The only thing in there is beer cans, by the way. Oh, God. I wish I had a trash can for beer cans. I just leave them on my desk. So I just have, like, fucking 40 beer cans on one desk. All right, real talk. It gets crowded. Real talk, everybody with some sort of office. 
what is the condition of your trash can? Because mine is fucking disgusting. It's like black with all these like drips and stains down it. It's it, it's, it's all bad. I'm like, I, if if I had to rate my trash can, I would say uh, four. I'd give it a four. Out of five or ten? I, We're out of four, I, I give it a four. Just a four in general. <laughs> One of those trash cans. So, so like a golf four. Like when somebody yells four, you get the fuck out of the way of it. Drinking Rolling Rock on a Rolling Rocker. Look, I'm drinking Rolling Rock because it's green. It comes in a green can. It's St. Patrick's Day. You gotta celebrate. Be festive. You can't go outside, so we hanging out in the on the web with the crew. See, I'm hey, I'm, I'm drinking Nitro <laughs> Irish Stout because I want to be authentic. And it's so Irish that it's brewed in Colorado, USA. <laughs> Speaking of which, that sounds like you guys. You guys ready for the sound? You ready? Here it goes. Oh, what in the top fuckery is going on around here? Oh shit! It's Jack! Oh my God. Is Jack Sirius? Are you serious? <laughs> yes, I am. I'm Jack Serious, and if you don't know Serious, you don't know Jack. Please don't punch me. Oh no, you're you're protected by contract. You're fine. This isn't this isn't Tom Fulp. I want I want the special guest to be Tom Fulp. <laughs> I want I want Tom. I got Fulp a report from the phone. agency that you all were drinking a little too much, so I had to quiet the party down and leave a PSA to y'all. <laughs> Are Don't you serious? Drive, especially because of the coronavirus. When you're drunk, you're more susceptible to it. That's you actually that true. That I don't know if that's true. It is true. Yeah, it, like no, if you. If you alcohol kills the coronavirus. No, 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 no. Alcohol is made with large portions of sugar, and sugar kills your immune system. And yeah, I don't, just that. I don't know if that's true. I, I don't feel like I'm a doctor. Like, okay, think, that is a fact. I don't think also, when you're drunk, so. you end up touching a lot of people, especially uh, when you're at the parties, and you never know what kind of germs can you go in and out. You know what I'm saying? No, that's not that's true. true. When I've been about. drinking, We're all in quarantine. I touch myself a lot. I'm doing it right now. <laughs> that's exactly, you're a disease. Oh, you know, burn! I'll infect myself. That was a serious burn. Serious Real burn. Fashion. Real fashion, can you do Tom Fulp impression since he's not here? Can you do Tom Fulp impression? He's fucking here. He's just, he says, I haven't drank enough to join this, and it's pissing me off. I gotta let y'all on a little secret here. A little secret here. Tom Fulp's a pussy. Oh, oh, Tom. That's no secret. That's no secret. Everyone knows. Tom, are you gonna get on air and respond to these very serious allegations? He knows. Fight. Yeah, seriously. Fight. It's time. Well, I'm going to head on out, but I just thought I'd stop by to let y'all know that if you don't stop this, and I'm going to have to rip up that contract to start throwing some punches around. No. no. Thank you, Jack Serious. No, Mr. Serious. Please. Don't hurt me, Mr. Serious. <laughs> Tom Fulp is my least favorite Newgrounds user. Right? He's the worst user. He's a great owner, but terrible I user. I literally cannot name one thing that Tom Fulp has been a part of. I can't. Listen, I can't even name a single Tom Fulp project. When was the last time he posted a game to Newgrounds? Okay, what like cathode ray bots? Oh, 2011 Tom, keep up. Might have been P Man the game. He collaborated with a fucking genius. Okay. How okay. come his level is so low? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to go there. It's a disgrace. <laughs> no, you're you're exactly right. I got I got to take exception to that. You can't call people up for having low levels who've been on the site forever. <clears throat> no, you can't call Lewis. Them. <laughs> Lewis, second worst Newgrounds user. He's not here, but I'm calling him out anyways. Okay. So yeah, speak, speaking of Newgrounds, we've been doing this for almost half an hour, and I don't think we've talked about Newgrounds once <laughs> on the Newgrounds so, podcast. Up was that and right? now, oh, that's Jesus. why this is the best episode ever. Yeah. <laughs> Because it's not about... Oh, guys, I'm sorry. I, I tried to hold Jack back. I couldn't stop him. I, I'm, like, sore because he just kicked my ass. Oh, shit. What up, oh, no. real faction? Mr. Faction, oh, tell us about Newgrounds.com. R to the F. Please. About Newgrounds? Yeah, uh, please tell us well, about Newgrounds.com. Well, I think... More people aren't giving it the credit it deserves around the net. And as more sites no. fail, uh, it's rising 
and continuing to uprise uh, in the creative community for a place that more artists should do things and advertise their services because Newgrounds will never let you down and Newgrounders never say die. Newgrounds is never gonna give you up, never gonna let Ooh. you Ooh. down. No! <laughs> no right Rick Rowland, no I Rick Rowling in here. If, if I if I can be a if I can be a surrogate Tom Falp for one second, Tom Falp has often referred to Newgrounds as the cockroach of the internet. You can't fucking kill yeah. it with a nuclear bomb. You gotta slice that is it up. true. After everything Newgrounds has been through, I'll be honest, the Geometry Dash uh, incident, I thought that was it. I thought that was it for Newgrounds. I thought it was going to, like, die if nothing was done. So that's why, like, you know, me and the mods were like, okay, something's got to be done about this. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, here's the thing. We've got a lot of new users, so you have to explain what was yeah, what is that? the Geometry Dash incident. Hey, we got some, oh story time. We got history some real time. content yeah. now. Yeah, I remember the history. <laughs> I guess I'm the history content. guy. I was there. Josh and I are like the history guys. What is it, what uh, is that? You call me guess. old, motherfucker? Well, I mean, we've been around for like almost 20 years now. I've been around. Old, Your mama. Old. old. Oh shit. Oh. This guy's got the jokes. This guy's got the jokes. Oh man. What's the geometry so. dash? <laughs> geometry dash. Yes. <laughs> oh man. Fiasco. All right. So for all of you new new grounders, um, man, that's weird to say. It, what do you call a new users of new grounds? Because there's new, new in the title. Newer ground. Noob grounds. Noob grounders. Noob grounders. Yes. Okay. Noob we'll go grounders. with that. All right. Uh, no, but not. That's not like any any out of hate. <laughs> we love you guys. Any uh, Gen Zers. Add that to um, the wiki. So. Tell us about the fucking incident. <laughs> Real, all right, faction, all right. real faction's been losing his train of thought. He needs to put down the bottle. Put down right, the all right. bottle, Mr. All right, so I made a, an entire um, podcast about this back in 2016 when I went on an episode of Talking Real, my podcast series. And wow. the click away from it's this hard to believe it's, it's hard to believe. So. <laughs> Advertising yourself on the Newgrounds podcast. This is history. This happens. What, what episode there. number was it? <laughs> uh, I don't know the episode uh, number. It's on the playlist. <laughs> if you look it up, uh, it, there is. Uh, it, it is in the title, Geometry Dash. So if you find it in like 2016 in my submissions or the playlist, you'll find it. Newgrounds.com so, um, slash audio slash seventeen eight four one zero. <laughs> no anyway 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 so so geometry dash um 2016 well actually this goes before 2016 so a few years back i think before that i think it was um geometry dash was a thing where Ro a guy named rob top made a game where it could integrate new grounds in such a way that uh he I, I think his intentions were, were he meant well, you know, but it didn't really end up going the way that it should have gone. I mean, Newgrounds users were like, hey, we can play Geometry Dash, but we can, uh, you know, make levels, uh, you know, from these Newgrounds songs and, and link them and they'll get more traffic. And that did work. That That's the part of it that did work, because there's been a few of my songs that have been used uh, in the <laughs> thing that got like loads of views from that. Yeah, it actually did help. Um, but the repercussions is there's a lot of like, I don't know, middle school kids or whatever that didn't read the, the rules. And even like this banner that said Geometry Dash users, it was like really huge. They were like, come on, there's a big, huge billboard here. And, and they didn't like read it, I guess, or didn't care. They're like, never I don't can. care. <laughs> uh, sorry, that was my Mickey Mouse voice. Uh, yes. Anyway, <laughs> um, so. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, <laughs> I I can't couldn't watch Yu-Gi-Oh today. I better upload some no stolen music. Or so I, I don't know. Wish I could be. <laughs> oh jeez, oh, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite Mickey Mouse impression. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> All right. Anyway, if anyone has requests after this story, um, I do voices anyway. Um, God, advertising. I'm not here to dance for you. Okay. Anyway, 
Geometry Dash. So what happened was essentially a few years went by and it grew and it grew and Newgrounds had like loads of more traffic, but there was loads of more stolen songs. I think the mods said there was an average of, I think at its peak, a thousand stolen songs they had to delete every single week. And that was like out of control. And that was threatening Newgrounds. Like like people would upload Skrillex to Newgrounds or whatever. Mm -hmm. and, and so they were, um, you know, making it so Newgrounds was, I think Newgrounds was getting contacted by labels, and Tom can fill in on this if he wants to, like, if to confirm that. But I heard something uh, along yeah, the way. Yeah, Tom, unmute, unmute. <laughs> uh, or he can type. Tom, he can Tom, type Tom, if he wants no, to. No, he can't type. Um, I, I think, that's the thing. Fuck. That's nothing I can confirm. I want to say I heard something along <laughs> those lines happen. Um, yeah, he's had issues of people using copyrighted music in their movies, too. But that was just on top of the thing. But that was putting Newgrounds... You know, it was giving Newgrounds the wrong attention Hot to where water. potentially labels could contact Newgrounds. Because I think Nintendo contacted Newgrounds at some point and said, oh, you can't do Mario stolen stuff anymore or whatever. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I think that was like a thing. Um, and so uh, it, it's progressively gotten worse uh, to where it's been harder to use like copyrighted stuff on Newgrounds. So Tom, uh, in 2016, when it got bad enough... Um, you know, Tom had everything replaced. Like, uh, for example, Madness Combat, the original Madness Combat used like a copyrighted chicken dance techno song or whatever, and that had to be replaced, which is so unfortunate because that's what made it so iconic. It's probably still on YouTube somewhere with the original song, but um, yeah, uh, so eventually, as the years went by, it got worse and worse and worse. So eventually, um, you know, Newgrounds was on the, the verge of getting probably DMCA'd off the net uh, because of potentially getting the uh, wrong attention and labels probably eventually wanting to contact Newgrounds and say, hey, well, here we go. And and Tom was getting kind of antsy about it. And a lot of people like the mods were overworked. They were overworked, uh, you know, just working themselves to death, even though it's a volunteer thing. But it's like, crap if we don't do this newgrounds is in trouble and it was like thousands and thousands and thousands and oh my god songs so all these kids are doing that and and uh rob wasn't like saying anything about it i don't think like so what happened was and and here's a little bit of a um, uh plot twist that <laughs> may get some people mad at me but um say uh, it say it Incense. the mods had requested that you know, I had tried contacting Rob Top, and I think Tom tried, but Rob was like, well, we're working on something, but they didn't really work on it because it took a couple years, I guess. I don't know. But apparently, uh, when I flagged the game on Steam and got it taken down for the copyright issues, that is the plot twist. Um, dun, dun, dun. I took the heat because I didn't want the, the mods, because the mods were getting death threats Snitch. from these kids. Is this the... Is this... Wow. Yeah, it got seriously bad. Like they were I didn't death threats. Part. Yeah, no, I saw it. it but the, the, keep in mind, they are kids. They have tempers. They're like, where am I? You know, but yeah, yeah, yeah. All those kids grew yeah. up, and they hopefully learned that Newgrounds Probably, is the, um, the next Napster. <laughs> no, but they, see, because a lot of these users, they did not use Newgrounds casually. They just went to Newgrounds for Geometry Dash. They're like, Newgrounds is a place yeah. to dump my shit. The the way it uh, sounds, like, it's like uh, the Geometry Dash set it up so that you'd have to fucking use Newgrounds to put in like whichever song you wanted. Custom so they had music. To, like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so they a lot of them didn't even want to go there. Yeah, so they didn't even want to go there. Like, so they just had like to, to like get the put put your. So like I'm thinking of other games that use audio to, uh, like control. No, you couldn't and... upload it. You no. couldn't just well, like you couldn't just take something off your hard drive into no. the game. No. I never yeah. played. No, so you had to. Use see, because Rob Top was like the database. Yeah, music. see, because Rob Top's idea was get Newgrounds more attention because it, cause, it you know linking back to Newgrounds, which it would get the artist more views, and and that worked. But at the same time, it turned into something it shouldn't have. It, the the users like were really really. I'm not saying all the Ge Geometry Dash users are bad because I've had like I've worked with a couple on some songs and and they're a great community. But there's a lot of the community that are like these kids who don't really find their morals yet because they're young and they're impressionable. I guess they they they're still looking through life and 
you know, discovering things, eat. you know? Dumb little but that's, they just, just don't drink like, enough. <laughs> it seems like you could just but, as easily, like, you know, like Beat Hazard or Audio Surf just allow people to, like, put their own music into it, you know, from their hard drive. Yeah, but it, essentially it was, yeah, that it, that would have been a solution, but I guess Rob really wanted to incorporate Newgrounds and they had this, this deal going yeah. on, and, and I, you know, and, and I get that, but Newgrounds was suffering and. And Rob wasn't really listening for a while. For I think a couple of years, they had tried to change things, and so I was like, you know what, this will make him listen. <laughs> so, uh, you know, flagging the game was like. And guess what? This is the weird part. Okay, this is the weird part of the plot twist. Two days later, they came out with a fix for it. Like in two days after that happened. So that that to me just kind of you know I'm like we were hmm. obviously working on it for many months at that point, and it just happened to line up. Yeah, come on. Well, and then yeah, the evil I real know. faction struck them what, down. What was the fix, though? But but at any point, you know, I I I, I messaged. <laughs> I remember like frantically like messaging Tom being like apologizing, be like, "Oh man, I'm sorry. I just had to I had to do this because I was afraid that you guys were gonna be in like deep shit if I didn't do it." And and uh, you know, but the mods were just like, oh, like I have some friends who are mods, and they were just like totally totally stressed out and i was like what do i do about this because i don't want new grounds to die but but here's the thing my plan was not to take down new um <laughs> new grounds geometry dash <laughs> take down new grounds my plan Time was guys. not to take down geometry Time dash for good. it was, it was just to get rob's attention and be like hey man we've been trying to get a hold of you like we gotta we gotta make some sort of uh adjustments you know we gotta you know you know, this is hurting Newgrounds. Like, you know, I wasn't like trying to kill it off be because I knew it, it would come back up, and it did. Two days later, it came back up with a, a fix, right? A patch, you know? What um, was the fix? And like, how did they fix it? Yeah, well, the well, Tom integrated this thing in Newgrounds, which is still a thing where um, it, if you check the box that says, um, what does it say? Something about external, external API or whatever. API. Yes. Like like Fultron. Fultron uses that API. Um, uh, allow external API use like Geometry Dash. There it is. It's like under down allow downloads, allow embedding at the bottom, like advanced options. If you allow that, as far as I know, any uh, users 2016 or before before that incident happened that are like approved users, and I think I'm one of them because I've had you people use my music, then you can use their music as long as that. Um, checkbox is checked but any new users beyond that um rob's like not allowing it like rob's just saying well it's this or the people before that but um if there was if this was really looked into i feel like it could be tweaked even more like i feel like there could be a, a better way to integrate maybe new artists as long as there was like permission if there was a way to check that box saying hey you can use my stuff in geometry dash but it's been so um, such a messy situation that <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's ever going to happen. But um, is it, but Geometry is it Dash is still with, alive. It's still is around. It associated with being scouted. Like if you're, are you? Does that box? Yes, you have to be scouted after you get scouted. Okay. But it does it show up if you're not scouted? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, that's Psycho what Goldfish. Doing. What's on the back end? Give us all the new ground secrets, Psycho Goldfish. I'll hack oh, into Newgrounds and steal all of it. Is there, is there somebody here that knows that stuff? Damn. Yeah. So here's the thing. Yeah, <laughs> if, Tom Fulp, if Tom Fulp would get okay. on, he could explain all of this. There have been too many sober people talking on this podcast, <laughs> right. and I'm tired of it. Okay, yeah, no, right, I Josh, what's Henry. your, uh, this, what's your side of the Is this the geometry story? dash I'm, I'm going to try this and all... explain this as best I can. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Around the same time Real Faction was talking about, we also noticed we had an extreme spike in our bandwidth and it was costing us a, a little penny to serve all these audio files on top uh, on top small, of small the issues of deleting all this, you know, copyrighted material. Um, so we decided we would get a hold of Rob Top and it was probably around the same time Real Faction messaged him actually. Um, so he was already kind of made aware that there were some issues and when tom talked to him yep. 
Um, we were like, you know, we've got all this copyright shit. It's starting to hurt our bottom line. You know, we need to come up with a plan together because we didn't want to just cut him off because it's a good game and his heart's in the right place, you know. And Tom's the fucking patriot seed of this type of shit. Anyway, <laughs> we um, ended up coming up with a solution where Rob Top would build basically what's like a white list of songs that are approved to work in Geometry Dash. And that was powered by that checkbox that Real Faction mentioned we added where you could say Whoa. you can use your game in uh. external API. So that wasn't built just for like generic shit. That definitely was built with the uh, Geometry Dash in, in mind. It just happens to work really good for Fulptron and shit. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> um, the cool thing is Rob Top actually stepped up and he's actually contributing to some of the costs that we accrue. So he's not just, you know, taking these songs and taking them willy-nilly. He's really stepped up. He's helping pay for the bandwidth we use and things like that. So he's definitely, once he was aware of the situation, did the right thing. So the guy's a stand-up guy. I can't say anything bad about him. And like Real Faction well, mentioned, when he did the game, you know, his whole intent was just to get more attention on the New Grounds audio portal. And, you know, a lot of people, you know, you wouldn't think, oh, gee, everybody's going to put up a whole bunch of illegal content on here. He was just like, oh, yeah, the audio portal's great. There's all these cool songs. Yeah. Let's get them in this game. So he, his heart was in the right place, and shit just happened. And it is what it is. Yeah. And, you know, we're, we're where we are now. You know, we've got the checkbox. We've, we're trying to protect everybody uploading new stuff and things like that. I mean, it's, it's, it's not as bad as it could have been. And... Now, going forward, yeah. it's actually pretty cool. You know, we got a cool relationship with him, and he's doing cool things, and it is what it it's is. got that cool system. Cool system. It's cool system dot exe. Yes. I, I, got a, I got a question. Is this the Geometry Dash episode, or is this the St. Patrick's <laughs> Ball episode? Oh. I would say yeah! Patrick. St. Patrick, what did he do? What did he do? How much did he drink? What was up with that? <laughs> Didn't it like get rid of snakes? Wait, I what? He, I thought he. I thought St. Patrick got rid of snakes. He, I thought he was the Lucky Charm guy. No. no. My my, my understanding is also, that, his yes. his story was exactly the same as the Pied Piper, but with snakes. Yeah. I, right. Yeah. There were like there but, were wait. snakes, and he got rid of them. He was like, no snakes. The no end. Way. The but end. At the end. <laughs> at the end, did he not like fucking uh, steal all the children or some shit? <laughs> Like a complete pedophile. No, that was the actual um, pipe pipe. Um, Guys, you can't hear this in the in, if you're listening on Newgrounds, you can't you can't see it, but Tom Fault is saying many racial slurs. Oh god. So many. Tom, so what many. the hell? I wish I That's could. No way we can off, prove it. There's I, no I way we can prove it. I don't even know where got... race some of these apply to. It's fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> I mean if <laughs> aliens ever slurs, get I've discovered, ever they're before. ah. <laughs> They're gonna have some hey, power well, this. Can somebody explain the gif that Wanda just posted? That's Maybe me scratching my back. <laughs> Who is that? Scratching his back. Sometimes your all make... sometimes your shoulder gets sore and you just gotta stretch it. You know? Yeah. I don't know. Mm. Hey, can somebody just put, can somebody explain the the gif that Henry Eyes just posted? <laughs> Dance. Self-explanatory. It's Henry dancing. Henry dancing. I'm doing the same dance right now, honestly. I haven't stopped. I've been doing it the whole podcast. Jazz. I'm surprised dance. we're not all doing that. Mm, yeah, yeah, mm, yeah, yeah, mm, yeah. How many mm, accounts mm. do you ban every month, Psycho Goldfish? How many? How many people? How many twelve-year-olds just... do you find on? I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be honest. I I hate moderation, and I don't do any of it. <laughs> oh. Fired. Fired. Oh, Fired. That. Oh. I'm a man. I'm a builder, guys, not a destroyer. Okay. Fired. <laughs> he Fired. Builds, he doesn't destroy. He lets those. He's a libertarian. He lets them roam. He lets those. He Lib puts all those twelve-year-olds in one box, and they have to fight each other. Let me put it this way with my angelic voice. You used to say, "Live and let live." And that's it. I'm not going to go any farther because live and let live is enough. That's all of it. That's, you know that's you it. You did, you know you did, you know you did. Break out in song and dance. Here's a, here's a, here's a thing because we also talked about uh, Exit the Gungeon at the start of this, right? Yes. What's, uh, what's some of your favorite Newgrounds stuff that has gone beyond Newgrounds? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, you mean like universally like acclaimed? Yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. Stuff that's like 
you know, started on Newgrounds and went went further. Have you guys um, heard of a game series? called Geometry Dash? <laughs> <laughs> God. Um, the Madness series. The Madness series, if I recall, was like on Albino Black Sheep, and it had like on other sites, if I recall. But that's like all over the net. That that started off with, it, and that first tune was viral. It was his first uh, Madness tune, and that just blew up all over the net. And uh, yeah. what was this? Two thousand three, two thousand two, like real early in the net days. And um, you know, I just remember, you know, it was it was a phenomenon. So. If I had to choose anything, you know, and I'm still a huge fan of the Madness series, like almost 20 years later. Jeez, it's been almost 20 years. Yeah, but I, I discovered that my brother, my older brother, is a Madness fan. I didn't, I didn't actually know, but uh, he, he used to like draw art, but I didn't know what Madness was back then. But like, just, just, uh, I think about a year ago, I actually figured out, holy shit, that was fucking Madness art. He was drawing Madness characters and shit. <laughs> Turns out he's an evil madness troll who has uh, done some stuff that I can't mention You're right phony. now. He's a phony! He's a fucking phony! He's a fucking phony! My, uh, my answer to my own question is probably Edmund McMillan's games. Like, uh, name, oh, Meat Boy! Binding yes. of Isaac. But yes, also Meat Boy. Ah, uh, um, yeah. Super Meat Boy is an amazing game, but Binding yes. of Isaac defined the last, like, eight years of my life. Hmm. So you guys talking, like, Let the game... Are you talking, like, games that started on Newgrounds and then went on big? Or are you just talking well, about developers in well, general? It, People, just, media, just, no, Not whatever. just games. Yeah, Everyone. yeah, media. Stuff that started... Well, I mentioned Madness. Media. That was an animation. I mean, madness. you can do, like... Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Mad... There's, there's a lot. I mean... Pencil there is a whole bunch. Uh, what I would recommend, if, if anybody hasn't picked a favorite yet, uh, Tom actually created a Newgrounds Games curation uh, group on Steam, and there's a lot of cool shit on there. Mm. Um, but like, oh yeah, not like shit like I'm a part of that. My friend Pedro, like, come on. Yeah. My oh, I just got that. that. I need to play it. The dream, the dream is to get on that on that curation <laughs> page one of these days. <laughs> Kim, you you just casually mentioned something. What was the thing that you casually slipped? Pencilmations, Pencilmations, big is. YouTube channel. They're they're like one of the. Are they? I feel I feel like they're like one of the big big. You know, they got like fifteen million YouTube subs. Okay, okay. If we're gonna mention Pencilmation, then is this gonna be the episode that we finally talk about? Ego Raptor. <gasps> I was actually about to bring them up in the game series or the awesome series. I'm good with talking about Ego Raptor. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm a big fan of. Let's do it. On the podcast, somebody hit him on. Let's get him on right now. Let's just ask him. Hey, we could get him on. That would be a miracle, and I doubt that would happen. But I just I don't know if Tom would like that. I I'm not. Who cares? Tom's a little bitch. How many times we gotta say this? I, I can't. I, God, I wait, asked right. Tom. Sober. I asked to Tom. Say. Wait, 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 wait. Somebody said I'm not going to say who, but what now? I can't speak for Tom, asked... but what I can say, just from what I know, is Tom really doesn't have any ill thoughts towards Ego Raptor. We're we're cool with Ego Raptor. We'll just I, leave it at that. Yeah, I go like beyond Ego Raptor. Yeah. There, there were a number of of artists who kind of made it big on Newgrounds and, and moved on to bigger and brighter things, but uh, didn't share that love with Newgrounds, so to speak. Um, yeah. One, one of those people, I had asked Tom if it was cool if we got him on the podcast, and Tom said, probably don't. Probably don't do that. And so... Uh, Tom, I can tell you why. So I, I don't know. Well, no, it wa it wasn't Ego Raptor. It was somebody else. But um, oh, oh, okay. Well, now so, I so need I to like... do the math. Spicy. Let's get let's get a few more drinks into Good L. See if you'll <laughs> very <laughs> chilly. The, the truth was, it was well, me, me. You want me to tell you If I got on the podcast, I wouldn't get any work done. That was the problem. And then here I am. Oh no. <laughs> and then, well, well, see, and I know the reason why because. I've listened to the Game Grumps like for years, almost on a daily basis. To the point where I'm like, oh, you know, this is like a guy I hang out with, but I don't actually hang out with. 
I, I was going to mention that was you. That It felt weird talking to you the first time because I'd already seen so many of your like videos and podcasts and stuff like that. And the first time I talked oh, yeah. to you, it felt so strange because it's like, ah, oh, I've fucking heard like hours of this guy, but he's never talked yeah. to me. <laughs> okay, just, just, just to recap, Henry Eyes has actually been like one of my probably one of my most loyal and avid followers uh like on youtube and newgrounds so he's like been everywhere with me and like i see his comments sometimes like oh cool hey henry i have a question to all of you i have a question to all of you uh what, what, how many like is there a specific instance where you you mentioned uh newgrounds irl like in front of someone that you didn't think would know it or yeah, you know yeah definitely all the 100%, time yeah yeah, I'll start this one. So I, uh, and this is kind of probably a sort of goofy answer, but I, uh, I definitely talk about Newgrounds IRL with people who have no idea what the hell Newgrounds is. Yes. Uh, for example, I uh, started a new job in December, and I've got this one coworker. He's the guy that that trained me to do my job, and uh, I've definitely kind of, you know, got him into. Newgrounds as a thing. I've been talking about, you know, the podcast and uh, just general Newgrounds work. So it, it is definitely yeah. a thing that I talk about. On the other hand, though, despite talking about it, people are still kind of like, what is this? You know, so it is an interesting sort of thing to kind of breach that subject. Um, it's always interesting and, to see that sort of uh, people bringing people to Newgrounds. Yeah, well, and I hate to say this, but it is also kind of a weird thing to try to get people into Newgrounds when yeah, when when adult content exists on Newgrounds. And yeah. uh, it's kind of like, hey, this is a place where anything can exist and, and thrive, but it's also kind of like people... Well, it's like Tom said in the last episode of Crickets where he was kind of like, you know, if people say, hey, Newgrounds, isn't that a... A hentai site it's because they were <laughs> looking for hentai and found new grounds oh god somebody like... actually did that i was fucking i was yeah. on a long ass bus journey and there are these two americans <laughs> fucking like rich kids oh we just finished our fucking marketing degree and we're gonna travel europe and shit like that so i was like i was playing the binding and ice uh, vice and shit and look uh uh and like uh fucking dming people on new grounds and shit and i asked them about new grounds if they fucking knew it uh, and one of them actually did, and he was like, oh, yeah, I used to fucking play meet and fuck games on there and shit. <laughs> <laughs> and we were just well, in, this like... fucking bus, uh, in this fucking bus, sorry, in this fucking bus, and there was, like, fucking moms and stuff like that. They were, like, ashamed of us. They're like, oh, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> meet and your fuck eyes, games in public? Because the <laughs> they, of they your own play home. lots of meet and fuck games. But that's kind of the weird thing about introducing people to Newgrounds, right, is it's... I feel very strongly that Newgrounds is the best place on the internet for artists. And it's Everything. hard to... It's a weird subject to breach when... when you're talking to people who don't know about it, you know what I mean? Yeah. When hentai gets in the way. Elements <laughs> like well, Deviant Tarpa better. Alright, I got some good stories on this, but who who else has stories first? Come on. I, okay, I have one last one, one last one. Uh, there was this uh, uh, girl I met in college, uh, and I I was gonna show her. Uh, I, I I don't I don't remember how it came into talking, but I I, I started talking about Newgrounds, and I wanted to show her Newgrounds. Uh, but the Wi-Fi, the college Wi-Fi, blocked it and said, ah, it's because it's a fucking porn site or some shit like that. <laughs> She's like, oh my uh... god, it's a fucking creepy porn site or some shit. I can't remember. <laughs> and she, she was so right. She was she was very creeped out. <laughs> And that, that's when you lean her and you say, I just want to break new grounds. <laughs> <laughs> just want to break grounds. And then she kissed you on the mouth. Exactly. That's what happened. And then she never talked to me again. <laughs> Locked me on every platform. I got one little quick story. Just a small one. I mean, I don't remember exactly who I've gotten into new grounds. There's been a few people because I, I remember there was like some voice actors trying to get like, you know, break out into the industry and the community and and uh i think one that comes to mind is oh shoot why can't i remember his name it's been a while well um whatever i mean shout out to anyone who i've helped i guess but i mean i'm like okay i sort of have a following i can help you out and now they seem to be doing really well and i'm like oh that's cool i actually got to help them but how i got into new grounds was like 
I was 11 years old back in 2003. And me and my cousins were like, I think it was Thanksgiving of that year or like one of the family gatherings. And, and, and I think, uh, I won't say his name, but uh, older cousin, like big brother, I guess, pretty much uh, to me, who got me into like anime and games or whatever. He was all like, uh, how old was he? Shit. Um, I think he was like 17, 18 at the time. I don't remember. And he was like, oh, yeah, just don't look at the ads. You, I, I really shouldn't be showing you this. I'm like, come on, I want to see this. But this Actually, was back when there was hentai ads. So, <laughs> this, this girly zoo! This fucking... <laughs> girly zoo. So that's how I found Newgrounds. Yeah. If you don't know yeah. about girly zoo, then you're young. God, I'm very young. Oh, jeez. Pretty fucking... Okay fucking something I, I i don't know if i ever told this story on this podcast but the way i came across newgrounds is i was uh i think i was six years old maybe seven years old uh, a new au pair uh came from i think it was uh kenya uh and she uh, we were playing fucking games on this german flash game site Spiel auf, or maybe it might have been mini clip and she just uh Wait, she what? sort of came over uh and showed her, she, she was like hey do you guys want to see a fucking cool site a fucking crazy site, and then she typed in fucking new. Oh, edgy. Yeah, we couldn't fucking read, so we called it Newsground for like fucking ten years. <laughs> Newsgrounds. Uh, <laughs> Newsgrounds. I love Newground. Newsground dot com, and then we played like fucking Ed's World games and Flash games and shit. But it was it was like the hardcore site, and we couldn't find it for a, a while. Shoot Justin Timberlake. Exactly. Oh yeah. Wade's uh, first <laughs> submission, or not Wade, I was reading the chat, um, Lewis, why did I say Wade? They, they just presented it as such a fucking, uh, what was it? Like, like, oh man, do you want to play a, the fucking hardcore side of like edgy games and shit? Because we kept, we kept typing in shit like shootinggames.com, crazy, <laughs> violent games, <laughs> like stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, and then there was like stick figure stuff but there was like a kind of a battle between oh, new rounds and like stiff stick death.com i think it was called yeah which which makes me think by the way fucking uh we weren't allowed to play video games back then like my my mom was like oh the fucking what? video games are devils they're gonna make you shoot shit and whatnot so we we're only allowed to play flash games which ironically Damn. flash games are way more violent than fucking actual <laughs> yeah. video games there's like ah oh, how to Very murder independent. a fucking stick figure yeah exactly there's like all sorts Dude. of like sex and violence and shit Especially the stick figure ones, you wouldn't fucking sink. But I don't know. My mom was uh, not as bad. I, that actually really surprised me. My mom was almost that bad, but she was like, um, "You can't watch Power Rangers unless the animals represent the Lord." Oh well, the Power what? Rangers represent what? the Lord. Okay, you can watch because they represent the Lord. And then, Good like Lord. with video games, it would. <laughs> yeah, she. I grew up religious. So screw that. But um, <laughs> so. So, so with Smash Brothers, when Smash the original Smash Brothers came out on Nintendo 64, me and my neighbor, who also got me into a lot of games, he would come over and we would play it. He would bring his 64 and be like, or, or I, yeah, and I would go over there. He'd come over there, and um, and I was like, is Kirby a girl? And and then is Samus a girl? And Mom found out, and she's like, you can't be playing as girls. Don't beat them up. Just choose the male characters or whatever. And I like how I'm just do doing my mom's voice in a Mickey Mouse voice. <laughs> Um, oh, oh, oh. Wait, yeah, gonna the they have breasticles. <laughs> you can't watch anime. I don't want you getting the girls with big googly eyes. If you play as a girl character, you'll grow boobs. <laughs> oh, Jesus only loves men. Oh, oh sweet. I can squeeze them now. <laughs> <Still>. <laughs> Just imagine like looking down and I'm like, oh, there they are. It's happened. I'm seven years old and I have breasticles. <laughs> if you grow enough weight, it happens. God. It feels like a personal attack. <laughs> um, but eventually so, my what mom... kind of stories do you have? <laughs> psycho goldfish. All right. So, yeah, Psycho Goldfish. You said you got stories. First, first, thing, first things first. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. We're just going to end up making I a compilation that, of like every time that that's had... happened in this episode. Not, I wish not enough. You had told me that was coming so that we could have side synchronized. Synchronized, synchronized can opening. All right, so <laughs> I've got. I I've could got, like sample that and make that into song. I've got two stories that are probably amusing. 
Uh, well, yeah. I guess we'll go oh, with dude. the first one. I'm, I'm okay. So I don't know. Most of you guys probably don't have kids. I've got like three of them. Anyway, my youngest daughter is the Yay. my youngest kid. My daughter is the first time this ever happened. I'm standing outside the elementary school. It's got to be like first grade, I think. And I've got my new ground shirt on. And all of a sudden, this dude looks at my shirt and he goes, "Oh, new grounds! I used to love that site." And I go, "Yeah, I work. I, I, I work there." And he's like, "Oh, okay, cool." And like. That was it. It was just like so awkward after that. It was weird. It was all. It, it was almost like he was like waiting for somebody to be another Newgrounds user who he could kind of get in vibe with, and all of a sudden he was ashamed. <laughs> I like how he said "used to like it." Yeah, exactly. Oh my God, it went down. Like the average. That's like the most condescending state. <laughs> I used to like Newgrounds That's before like the, the most the condescending thing, went thing you can down. say. About Newgrounds, that somebody's like, "Hey, I used to like that." That that's like that scene from Goodwill Hunting or, or whatever, where uh, that guy just like tries to show what a know-it-all he is. So, I used to like Newgrounds when my wife let me play meat and fuck games. <laughs> 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 but then her boyfriend gave me a switch. Yes. <laughs> All right. The other funny story, and this is like more family-related. So my nephew. Uh oh. <laughs> At the time, my nephew's got to be, God, he's got to be like 11 or 12. I don't know. And then all of a sudden, out of the blue, my sister-in-law knows where I work, knows the website, and all of a sudden. <laughs> and she's like, why is my son on this newgrounds.com with all this porn and stuff? <laughs> and I'm like, I hate to break it to you. And this was after we did all the filters and stuff where like all the A-rated stuff was hidden by default. So I'm like, I hate to break it to you, but for him to find that... He went looking. <laughs> yeah. Why is that such friends a thing? probably why told do, him about it. Why do parents not want their kids to look at porn? How is that like the worst thing a fucking eleven year old boy could do is search up ass on the well, here, here, here. Let's ask the parent. Let's ask, wait, no, no, no. Let's ask the parent. Psycho goldfish. Why is it the worst thing for, people, for kids to look at? Personally, I don't care. It's going to happen if it happens. Everybody has the internet. But here's, here, here's the funny thing. So my sister-in-law, when we first, like, my wife and I first got married, we lived in South Dakota. We ended up moving to Colorado, and we ended up living with her for a little bit just to get our feet settled and shit. And I don't know what happened. I was watching, like, Dragon Ball or something like that, and I accidentally got her into anime. And so wait accidentally well you know I, I don't watch like a ton of anime but i always love dragon ball and some of that old school shit and she got into like crazy anime and so now this is before she had any kids mind you and now she's gotten a little older and she's got two kids and she's basically shared her love of anime with them well what she used to be into was you know stuff you would see on actual tv like you know trigun cowboy bebop shit like that so she got her kids yeah, into all yeah. that, and they found all the stuff that you don't find on American TV. <laughs> oh. So it, it's no surprise no. that they went looking for specific things and found it on the uh, old newgrounds.com. Why the heck is Bulma naked? What the heck? What is wrong <laughs> with this? this? Is this? You, know how it always, you know how it starts? You know how it starts? It's basically some kid going... What does this look like, but naked? You know, because you don't know. see what, like, it, it's a, it's that curiosity. It's kind of like saying, what's behind this wall? Like, what's behind door number one? You know, it's like, you're but curious what, to see what. I, I still see remember the first time I saw a cartoon porn. It was so insane, because the, the art style was, like, so in sync. I don't know. It was, like, perfectly rec recreated. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, that's the thing I noticed, the too. It, it was the, the, it was older, the older stuff too. was, like, exactly the same as the real anime. Like, now the fan stuff, you can tell that it's fan art. But back in the day, it looked official. Yeah, there's some dedicated <laughs> did. People, some actual fucking artists. And, and comics. I, I can't remember the, like, it's been a while, but, like, the, the first time I saw Optimus Prime naked, oh, my God. <laughs> me too. Me too. That's that's the moment I realized. I wasn't aware. It's time for my dick to roll out. <laughs> <laughs> that's when I fell in love with Newgrounds. <laughs> oh, um, oh man. 
and now I'm doing a podcast about it? Good lord. <laughs> so so remember, when you tell any of the kids about Newgrounds, just avoid anything with the A in it. No, specifically mention that. That's how you get them. What you need avoid to, the letter A. What you need to if you, do, if you, kids, if you see the letter E, T, and M, uncheck them all and click the A. That's all you need. <laughs> a for only adults. And then you get like the B you rating on Strawberry Sean, Clock. You know baby, aren't you? <laughs> a, a I remember always. there was you want to know the most baffling thing I've ever seen like on Newgrounds not get caught for the longest time um Tom's probably not I don't know if Tom will like not like this but he's not listening right now so um <clears throat> so there was this Pokemon Nurse Joy comic and this is something I stumbled on as a kid mind you I, I it was rated E I think, yeah, this was under the, the E rating at the time. Oh, so it was totally I was like, safe, oh, it's a... God's uh, work. Yeah, well, there's <laughs> what happened. So uh, it was, like, about Nurse Joy. And I'm like, oh, it's I'm a huge fan of Pokemon because that was, like, one of my first anime shows. Some people don't count it as anime, but it is. it is. So get over that. Um, it is. So, and this was, like, the late 90s when I watched Pokemon. But this was, like, 2003, 2004 when I saw this. Like, for the longest time. The, this Nurse Joy, <laughs> I think they call them Dojenshis or the porn oh, comics yeah. or whatever. Oh, yeah, and hentai.com. Go and visit that. <laughs> this was an E rating. Newgrounds. And I went back to read that comic several times for, I think, two or three years before it finally got personal, taken down. For personal purposes. <laughs> want to go back. Like, God, literally, this thing stayed up. This did not, this went under the radar uh, for, like, two to three years. This did not get, like, caught. And I'm like, How? You know, because people like stupid. real faction didn't flag it. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> See, they were like, "Hey, if we don't tell her. anyone, we can jerk off to this multiple times." <laughs> <laughs> you just bookmark this. Great, great, Henry. Now people are gonna make fan art of me doing that. <laughs> I love it. If, if you weren't gonna make fan art of this, please do it now. Do it now. Draw. I mean, I already made a song. I made a song from the last episode. So I mean, all of us make sure you put it on the art portal and make it rated E for everyone. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's right. You heard it here first. Staff from Newgrounds recommends safe, people to safe put Safe sex. It has to be rated E. e. Send it to uh, Psycho Goldfish's son. Oh God! Oh God! <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I guess oh, no, nephew, my sons are old enough to look at most of that, so I'm not. <laughs> his nephew, send it to his nephew. Yeah. <laughs> what, what if like your your family members like come across Newgrounds again and are like, "Oh, hey, it's the Newgrounds podcast." Wait a minute. Wait a minute. My they, like listen that, to this episode. My family Uncle, Uncle doesn't Uncle recommend. Wolf? My family doesn't like check out anything I do. They're terrible. <laughs> God. It's probably not a. It's probably not a bad thing at this point. Yeah, no, that's fully justified. They don't check out things that you do for a reason. There's a reason I'm able to do what I do because they don't look. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know that he works at the uh, hentai fucking meat and fuck place. So what else should I do? Factory, pretty much the meat and fuck factory. He works at the company that makes the hentai games. Oh, it's funny, the one Pico day we went to, my wife came with me, and fucking Shadman was there. And if you're familiar with Shadman, he does not show his face in public. And I met him. The way my wife, like, Pico day? The way my wife looked at him was like, what the fuck is this guy? <laughs> like, a furry could have walked in in a full fursuit, and she probably wouldn't have raised an eyebrow at that. But seeing Shadman, she was like, what the fuck is this guy? <laughs> there's an air, there's an air. He's he's a funny character. I've seen I've seen pictures of his face. There's that one picture of his face that I think accidentally got uh, posted. Really powerful. Yeah, I, I I don't know if I should say that, but is he handsome? Cut that out. Cut that. Out. <laughs> Cut that out of the podcast. He's he's. he's... <laughs> oh, I do want to bring up one thing, uh, though. I um. If you want to do this, uh, you can edit this part to where it's like moved to the news part of the. Uh, if there, well, if there was even a news part of the this podcast, is this it is now. <laughs> well, non-canon. Well, uh, Josh, maybe you know something about this, but in the podcast or not the podcast in the Pico Day server, 
I was reading that mm -hmm. Ivan had announced that the, uh, ha the Pico Day party had been delayed to potentially summer due to the uh, coronavirus thing going around, which I IMO is probably a good idea. But um, I don't think it'd been like publicly announced. Yeah, yet. as far as I know, it hasn't been publicly announced either. Tom mentioned it when their uh, office Slack server that Pico Day is probably going to be delayed. But I don't know what the official status of that is. I'm not in the Pico Day. It server. probably isn't official yet, but yeah. it's it's looking like oh, that's man. what. I mean, May's coming up pretty quick, and shit is not looking good. They're saying this yeah, is yeah. going on well into August, so who knows. Stuff's just some people were talking about like a Pico out. Day yeah. road trip. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, hear, hear me out. We'll do we'll do Pico Day, but we'll do it in the like cyberpunk gothic yeah. vibe where we all wear gas masks. Oh yeah. god. My thought was we should do Pico Day on Discord with like three hundred people trying to talk at the same time. Yes, yes, please. That yes, was please. my oh, thought yeah, too. Good. I I was I said the same oh. thing. The well, lag on that, though. Right that's, what, that's what it was last year when we made that bullshit bootleg Discord server. I'm not gonna lie. When you're at a real, oh, yeah. when you're at a real Pico Day and there's like you know 150 people there, it's almost the same as all those people being on Discord at the same time. Let's be honest. Yeah. You can't get. You can't <laughs> talk to anybody. Free. It's just fucking insane. <laughs> God, God. But I guess we have to cancel our Airbnb then. Yeah. It's, it's, I guess it's better to mention it sort of sooner rather than later. Yeah. Uh, since, like, flights and stuff, but... See, I'm not really involved in the whole Pico Day thing, but I agree. If it, if it's canceled, they should, like, straight up announce it soon so people can cancel whatever and get any money back they may be able to get. But it well, is... some places it's... are. Like, E3 is canceled, and there's concert tours that, that are uh, canceled, and uh, there's a lot of things getting canceled. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I was supposed I, to go to Canada this last weekend. And my grandma's got COPD, basically lung cancer. And oh no! Oh no! I, I was gonna go up there and visit her one last time, and well, hopefully, not one last time. But you know, it is what it is. <laughs> anyway, I was gonna go up there. I hope it's not the last time. All of a sudden, they're closing down all the schools and shit, and I get this notice that there's like a kid in my son's school that's in quarantine. I was like, yeah. Probably not a good a guy. Not the best idea to go see an old lady with lung cancer at this point in time. Mm. So I cancel all that shit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it sucks. It is what it is. But the borders are closed. I thought. Uh, I thought yeah. Canada was closing its borders. Way to bring the podcast down, Josh. Jesus. Come on. God damn doing? it, Josh. <laughs> Fucking bum everybody out, you asshole. Edit that. Very, very That's the beginning of the podcast, so it's only up. So the podcast only goes up from there. We'll, we'll edit this part. Well, that's up. kind of the thing too. <laughs> that's kind of the thing too, isn't it? Though that uh, you know, this is like pretty real. Having everybody in lockdown. I mean, yeah. But hey, we're getting well, we're getting my everyday life. We're getting the I mean, highest I've been ratings this, that we've had in forever. Anybody. Come on. Yeah. I mean, yeah, Newgrounds is getting more views than ever. Everybody's <laughs> locked in. They gotta find somewhere to get their anime. They, yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say they, they gotta find go somewhere to, to get off. it anymore. <laughs> Maybe that's what we need to do on the uh, NGP podcast. Here is uh, audio hentai porn. <gasps> yes. Let's get Miss Moonified. Little Little Box says you can't go to the <laughs> hentai store. Any hentai store anymore. So. You definitely gotta go somewhere. The where the fuck does Little no! Box? Where does Little Box live? That there's an actual hentai store. Oh my. <laughs> it's time to dox. Guys, time. did you see the chat right now? Do you see what's happening? I try not to. No, I, I see the penises. I, I, I see the penises. Oh, no. I should have been quiet. I would love to if I was able to. It's an oh incredibly detailed yeah. image of real facts and twelve-year-old body naked and. Oh about. shit! Okay, I didn't see that, but now I saw it. It's like the boner that stretches out these like stretchy pants. So you won't believe it. Know. You won't believe it. It's kind of. It's kind of too hot for new grounds. Kind of. <laughs> So I found it, and it's incredible. I mean, oh great! Oh, and, that's gonna be floating around gonna, now. That, the way the sun that's gonna be the the, the way the sunlight like, glitters is pretty cool, but on the other hand, like the lack of hair is disturbing. You know, <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna have to cut out my a bunch of my audio. A lot of my my dang roommates making a big old ruckus. Hey, 
shut the fuck up, Cam. We should just make yeah. this version just all of his roommates, and that's it. Cut us out. <laughs> it's a nice little ambience. That nice. um, I don't hear anything. The whole episode and cut out every time anybody says the word hentai. So it's hentai. Ken's roommates and the word hentai. Make it. Did anyone say sleep. hentai? My name is H. Henry Eyes. The H stands for hentai. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Triple hentai H. Eyes. Yeah. His name is so versatile. It is very versatile. <laughs> Henry sighs. Henry lies. Henry dies. Henry flies. Oh, oh, hentai eyes. <laughs> Shit happens. Hentai and Henry eyes. eyes. Ban, ban Henry on Newgrounds right now. Yeah, I probably Don't should. Do it. Don't do it. Or yeah. mine. Can you delete my account? I can. I think, it'd be funny. <laughs> I think it's time. I've been here long enough. <laughs> I think it'd be really funny. Deleted my whole account. <laughs> I, I, I can do that right now. Pull the trigger. Right. Pull the trigger. Don't do it. End don't it. Do pull it. the trigger. Pull. <laughs> he doesn't know what he's saying. Hang on, End I'm it. doing it. I'm doing it. Hang on, one second here. Here we go. I gotta log into the server. Pull the first. trigger. <laughs> it's on. No, don't do it. Right. Pull the trigger. Hang put, on. put me out of my misery. I don't want to be on the site anymore. All right, hang on. I, I gotta remember my password. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Woo! Pull the trigger. Pull the trigger. Oh no. This is how this right. episode of the podcast is going to end. I die on new grounds. account gets deleted. And I didn't even get to mention me visiting an, an art school and uh, signing into someone else's art station account and commenting a bunch of bullshit. Oh. <laughs> but now I did Pull mention the trigger. That. So can end oh, now. No. Is it gonna happen? What are you gonna do, Psycho Goldfish? What are you gonna do to me? It's really hard. I have to type a lot of passwords to do anything on Newgrounds. <laughs> and it's really hard to remember my passwords when I've drunk this much. Wait, wait, what are those passwords? Yeah, give me your. I'll, I'll do it for you. I'll, I'll What's do your it social for you. security number. My, while my we're all my passwords for Newgrounds access are password one two three. It's really hard <gasps> to guess. Well, I'm gonna test it. Gonna right gonna I'm gonna test that shit. <laughs> I'm in. I'm, I'm in the system. It. You're in, aren't you? I'm in. I'm in. My account's gone, guys. It's gone. It's over. Oh! Ninja Muffin 99. I'm gone. I'm fading. I'm fading away. I'm looking at my hands. They're Wait. disappearing. And is it? Is it? Up. Is it Ninja under dash Muffin? No, or is Ninja it... Ninja Muffin 99. Oh, I almost Ninja Muffin 99. I almost killed the wrong Ninja Muffin. Whoo, that would have sucked. Pull the trigger. Pull the killed trigger. Everyone was Ninja in their name. <laughs> Do it. Do it. End me. While, <laughs> while we're at it, kill everyone's Wait, ego. I spelled and... something wrong. I have no, the wrong uh, No, you, you killed Psycho Lazy Fishes Muffin, didn't no, you? You didn't spell it wrong, you spelled it in drone. One, two, three. No, <laughs> I, I tried. I tried. Oh, wait. That's a uh, language. Wow, this is really hard to, That's like, uh, hard to do server-related no, stuff when Muffin. I'm drunk. <laughs> Ninja Muffin. That's like kind of like how other countries is like, we say color, but they say color, like with a U or something. It's called no, Canadian dialect. Okay. That. I'm pretty sure your name's not Ninja Miffin ninety nine. Hey, I Ninja found Muffin. you. All right, here we go. Pull the trigger. Pull Bam, the trigger right now. Pull time. the trigger. All right, it's going on. <laughs> Pull the trigger. <laughs> if you delete Ninja Muffin's like last couple letters in his name, that would be super bad. No people rename him to Ninja Muffin. No in, people with numbers at the end of their name are the best. They're not dumb at all. No, no, I'm talking about in the. In... Whoops! Finger slipped. Deleted Lazy Muffin. All right, I'm pretty sure you're. Like... I'm pretty sure I just deleted Ninja Muffin ninety nine. Anybody want to verify yes. that? Yeah, yeah. Uh, holy shit! Everyone go. Everyone... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm checking. I'm on newgrounds.com right now. I'm on there right now. We did it. Didn't Ninja Muffin 99 podcast. like have a another name or something? Oh uh, no, he still exists. <laughs> Wait. No, okay, I'm getting check in. I don't. Wasn't it something else though? That's the end of the. Oh, fuck, he's gone. <laughs> That's the end of the podcast. That's the end of the podcast. Wait, 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 wait. So what happens now? Like, are you? Do you recover that? It's or? gone. It's gone. No, he's 
done. Okay. He's gone. He's, he's dead forever. It's over. I'm fading away. I'm fading away. This is the last episode of the Newgrounds podcast. This is. The He's muted. He's gone. His Newgrounds account is deleted. That is all. That's it. Yeah, he's not even in the podcast episodes. What the hell? No, he's done. He's been he's gone. Podcast. I'm not even sure. He did actually delete it. We don't even wait. Know. Been wait a bit. So, so how do you undo that? How do you how do you get hit? You don't. You don't. You don't, you don't right? and, and for asking that question, I'm what do you what do you mean undo? And... <laughs> he's gone. It's he... over. Are, are you familiar with how deleting works? It's just, it's open. The hard drive was smashed. When you delete something, it's gone. That's how deleting works. He's gone. That's it. The end of Ninja Muffin. Now. Let's, let's have a short funeral for his game. Uh, whites only. Amazing grace. How and blacks sweet. only. The monster wishing. Let's say, Prom, I mean, probably, probably got the rich. I'm too like drunk. Fuck me. I can't remember any other of his games. Oh, Ritz. Who too. once was lost <laughs> and now was found.